Made in USA, 5 most deadly weapons in Moroccan army right now. Morocco and United States relations are bilateral relations between Morocco and the United States. Formal U.S. diplomatic relations with Morocco began in 1787 when the Confederation Congress ratified a treaty of peace and friendship between the two nations which had been negotiated earlier in 1786. Renegotiated in 1836, the treaty is still in force, constituting the longest unbroken treaty relationship in U.S. history and a lot of Moroccan military equipment is purchased from the United States. This is military equipment obtained from America. Number 1, M1 Abrams. The M1 Abrams is a third-generation American main battle tank designed by Chrysler Defense, now General Dynamics Land Systems, and named for General Creighton Abrams conceived for modern armored ground warfare and now one of the heaviest tanks in service at nearly 68 short tons, it introduced several innovative features, including a multi-fuel turbine engine, sophisticated Chobham composite armor, a computer fire control system, separate ammunition storage in a blowout compartment, and NBC protection for crew safety. Number 2, M109 Howitzer. The M109 is an American 155mm turreted self-propelled howitzer, first introduced in the early 1960s to replace the M44. It has been upgraded a number of times, most recently to the M109A7. The M109 family is the most common Western indirect fire support weapon of maneuver brigades of armored and mechanized infantry divisions. The British Army replaced its M109s with the AS-90. Several European armed forces have or are currently replacing older M109s with the German PZH-2000. Upgrades to the M109 were introduced by the US, see variants below, and by Switzerland, KAWEST. With the cancellation of the US Crusader and non-line-of-sight cannon, the M109A6, Paladin, will remain the principal self-propelled howitzer for the U.S. for the foreseeable future until the new M1299 will enter service. Number 3, MIM-104 Patriot. The MIM-104 Patriot is a surface-to-air missile system, the primary of its kind used by the United States Army and several allied nations. It is manufactured by the U.S. defense contractor Raytheon and derives its name from the radar component of the weapon system. The AN MPQ-53 at the heart of the system is known as the Phased Array Tracking Radar to Intercept on Target, which is a backronym for Patriot. The Patriot system replaced the Nike Hercules system as the U.S. Army's primary high-to-medium air defense system, and replaced the MIM-23 Hawk system as the U.S. Army's medium tactical air defense system. Number 4, BGM-71 TOW Anti-Tank Missile. The BGM-71 TOW is an American anti-tank missile. TOW replaced much smaller missiles like the SS.10 and ENTAC, offering roughly twice the effective range, a more powerful warhead, and a greatly improved semi-automatic guidance system that could also be equipped with infrared cameras for nighttime use. The resulting design was tube-launched, optically tracked, and wire-guided. BRL programmer Harry Reid immediately christened it, TOW, a name that the system carried into production. Number 5, M101 Howitzer. The 105mm M101A1 Howitzer, previously designated M2A1, is an artillery piece developed and used by the United States. It was the standard U.S. light field howitzer in World War II and saw action in both the European and Pacific theaters. Entering production in 1941, it quickly gained a reputation for accuracy and a powerful punch. 
The M101A1 fires 105mm high explosive, he, semi-fixed ammunition and has a range of 12,330 yards, 11,270 meters, making it suitable for supporting infantry. All of these qualities of the weapon, along with its widespread production, led to its adoption by many countries after the war. Its ammunition type also became the standard for many foreign countries' later models.